Hi everyone and welcome to Positively Kimmy. I am Kimmy. If you are new here, welcome. This is a safe space. And if you're one of my returning subscribers and my besties, hi guys, how are you? I hope you're all having an amazing day. Welcome to Timu Tuesdays. I have a fairly, a nice size Timu haul today. It's not too big, it's just moderate, but I think it's a nice size Timu haul. And I got some really interesting things. The first thing that I'm going to show you, because I have them on right now, I got a pair of stretch pants, leggings, joggers, whatever you wanna call them, um, which were a size 3X in Timu sizes, which is a size 18 all the way down from what I would normally get, which was a 5X, which was a 22, or sometimes I had to get a 6X, which was a 24, 26. So I'm really excited about that. I'm wearing them with this cozy lounge set that I have on, and I'm gonna get up and I'm gonna show you these first because I think they fit amazing. And some of my pants were getting a little too large and I wanted to see if I could go into like the normal sizes on Timu. Now they're, they're normal sizes go up to a 20 which is a 4x which is not normal in in american sizes i mean that's just not the way the world works but to get into a 3x and know that they're comfortable and they're soft and they've got a little bit of spandex in them i'm just so excited so give me one second to get up and show these to you so these are what the 3x look like on me i think they fit really well i mean they're not tight they're perfectly fine. I can bend down in them. I can bend over in them. They're perfectly fine. You can see my vision board back here. This is what they look like from the back. And it doesn't accentuate every curve, every bump, every lump, nothing like that. So I'm really excited about these. And I believe they were $3.77. And I'm going to order a ton more. <laughs> So let me know if you like those and the way they fit on me. I couldn't see them from the back and probably don't want to, but I'm just so excited that I'm in, I can go into Timu and I can go into their regular sizes and know that they're going to fit and not be too big because a lot of the things I've ordered have been too big um, lately, which I love saying. The next thing I got is so interesting. Oh my God, I couldn't believe they had this on there. I got a professional hair conditioner flat iron for five dollars and seven cents i took it out i used it and i did my hair with it and it came out perfect the only thing is that you should know about this and let me un <laughs> untangle it this part does not get hot so if you need to put a strand of hair in and go like this you can obviously it's not on right now it you put it on the power button. I don't have it plugged in at the moment. And the power button will light up here. It only goes to 220 degrees Celsius. So you cannot burn or fray your ends. Now, I have another one that I had gotten from somewhere. I don't know where I got it from. It's the Remington Style Therapy. It goes up to 450 degrees, which for someone who's in a rush, all the time like myself is wonderful but then the ends of your hair get completely destroyed so something like this might take you a little bit longer to do your hair with but to have it it's, it's not going to hurt, hurt or damage your hair and to have it as a backup and know that you can close it and touch it from here when it's on and not burn yourself or anything it worked just as well as that one that i just showed you does and i I fell in love with this. I think this is great to have as a backup or just on a day where you can take some time with your hair and you don't want it to get damaged. Always use like um, the spray to protect your hair before you flat iron your hair. I don't always do it and I know this and I know I used to practice what I preach, but I don't. Um, but this for $5 and what I tell you it was, $5.07. Where are you gonna find a flat iron for $5.07 that actually works? I am so amazed with this find. I think it was awesome. And I'm truly, truly happy with that. The next thing I got is for my mom. And I'm not gonna, yeah, I'll take it out. <laughs> I got another surge protector with the USB ports because 
you can't just you can't have enough of them. I have them all over my house, and my mom needed some because she has so many wires. So this one is two, four, six, eight prong, and then it has the C cable right here, and it has the USB ports right here, and it's perfect for charging everything, plugging everything in. To the left of me, I don't have one of these, so I'm going to put one of those there so I could put another <laughs> another phone charger right there instead of on this side. And I have my flat iron hooked up over here, and I don't have enough room for my little light that I have, my night light that I have. So I'm going to be using this there. But my mom has her computer. She has a lamp from Timu that needs to be charged in the USB port. Um, she has a cell phone. She has something else that needs to be charged. Oh, her, I don't know, something else that needs to be charged in here. She has a nebulizer. She has her oxygen tank. I mean, she has so many things. The oxygen tank actually gets plugged into the wall. But she has so many things that she needs this for. And I figured I'd be a good daughter and buy her one of these. And she had already gotten one. So um, I, otherwise, I'd show you that today, too. But I, I can't tell you how much I love these. They work so incredibly well. And how we lived without the USB ports and the C port, I don't know because I have them literally all over my house. The next thing I got, oh my God, I got a shopping bag. And I thought it was so cute, it's little bees. This is a large shopping bag. So when I go over Sissy's house to sleep at night, I always bring my heating pad, I bring a change of clothes, I bring my pajamas, and I usually will bring a drink or something like that. This one happens to fold into a cute little thing. And it was $2.78. So you just, how do I get this out? Um, and I believe it has, you turn it inside out and it's large capacity. And I absolutely love it. You can go shopping with it. The part that it's a pouch, it fits in here. This is a change purse kind of thing. And it is absolutely huge. Look how cute that is though. That is so cute. It goes and fits over your shoulder perfectly. It's lightweight, so you don't have to worry about, you know, having it from down your shoulder. It is huge inside. I mean, it just <laughs> goes on forever inside. I'm trying to get to show you that. I'm not doing a very good job of this, let's see. Let's see, can I do it? No, but it does go on forever. It is completely, completely big. And if you're going overnight somewhere, if you're going to a hospital overnight, um, it doesn't have a snap, it doesn't have a zipper, so it does stay open. If you're going to the grocery store, these last forever. I have one sitting right across from my vision right now that I have all the Timu stuff that I've ordered that I haven't put away yet. God knows, I, I, I just get so overwhelmed by some of this stuff sometimes. But I thought this was so cute with the little bees on it and the little hearts and the little flowers. And it just made me feel happy. So I needed one, I got one, it was $2.78. And I will be using this every time I go to Sissy's house. So that's something I'm not going to waste. The next thing I have is three pairs of reusable no glue needed self-adhesive eyelashes. Now you guys know I am an eyelash fanatic and I'm going to have a company one day called Lipstick and Lashes or a collab called Lipstick and Lashes. And I wanted to see how it worked with the no glue so I'll be doing a tutorial on this one day. And these were $5.93. I saw them on Amazon and on the internet for like $20 for a pair or $18 for one pair. I wasn't going to do that, so I'm getting to the box. There are three pair in this case. This is what it looks like. Okay, you got to pick from dramatic, natural, all that stuff. It comes individually wrapped and in this plastic container, which is really nice also. It looks like a little cosmetic case. And of course, I'm not going to be able to open this because I just can't open anything. <laughs> Oh, that, that's actually pretty easy. And they come like this. Can you see that? And these are wispies. 
and they don't look like they're overly long so you don't you might not have to cut them and whoops they come out like this and you would just take it off and supposedly it doesn't need glue and I can't wait to see how this works so as soon as I do a tutorial with the hair thing I will show you this as well I just dropped one so give me a second I'm just so curious to see how it's not going to need glue and They fit back in the container fairly easily, and that is it. So I can't wait to try these out, and I will try them out on camera because I think doing something for the first time on camera is the only true way of knowing if it's gonna work or not, because if I practice, then I'm kind of deceiving you guys, and I don't ever wanna do that. Next thing I got, I'm really disappointed with, but it was 58 cents, so it's okay. I got earring cuffs because you know I can't wear earrings because I'm allergic to anything that's not pure gold on my ears. And there are so many gorgeous earrings out there and I can't ever wear them. So I got a package of earring cuffs. I'm trying to figure out how to open the pack. Here we go. And they're so tiny. I mean, I know they're not supposed to be huge, but they're really, really tiny. I mean, this is like, let's see, the size of one of them which might not look, oh, that's two of them, <laughs> might not look tiny to you, but they're like the size of my pinky nail. And let's see if we can put this on. I guess it would go something, let's see, up here maybe. I don't know how that works. I know you can open it a little bit. And I've never worn an earring cuff, so I don't know. But, oh, that's cute. You're not going to be able to see it with my long hair unless I'm wearing a ponytail. But I think it's cute. I'm still a little disappointed. That came off way too easy. Still a little disappointed with the size of them. I think they should be bigger. There are about four or five of them in here. And different styles. And I'm just, you know, not thrilled with this. Okay, so... We're gonna keep them, we're gonna try them, we're gonna make them work, and we're gonna see if we like them or not. I'm just, I love to be an earring girl. Like, I love to wear big, long earrings. Like, I was, but I've never been able to. From the time I was a baby, when I got my ears pierced, they got infected, and I was always able to wear one in one ear and never in the other ear. And then, after a while, the holes closed up because, unless it was pure gold, the post I wasn't able to wear them and your girl here can't afford real gold earrings so you know it, it's just not something that's happening for me and I've tried where people have said to um, put nail polish on the backing and that didn't work for me either now I thought this was going to be bigger it's a file and I thought it was going to be a big one that I could put my paperwork in I could do, use this for like coupons or things like that this was $2.07, or $2.54, I'm sorry. And you open it up, and it's like this. It's an accordion-style folder, but I really thought it was a big one when I saw it in the picture. Um, so I will find a use for it. I can put my rent checks uh, after they've been cashed in here and just keep a record of those. I could put coupons in that. I will figure out a way to make that work. And let's see, what else do we have in here? I think I have one more thing. Oh, I got another tape measure. And the reason why is I got in the three, but the, the uh, end of this broke on my other one. I did not break it. It just broke. It's not like I, you know, when I was measuring myself, I broke it. But this part is very very flimsy and I was hoping if I just got the one that it would be more secure it doesn't feel like it is it feels like it's gonna come right off um, so I might just have to give in and get like a two or three dollar one from Dollar Tree or CVS or something but I just need it for the numbers so maybe it doesn't even matter if I have that piece or not but this was 79 cents so I didn't do bad on that then mama placed an order and she got three things and it's hysterical she got uh, excuse me she got plastic cups she got paper plates and she got toilet paper guys when I tell you 
don't order these. Don't, just, just don't, okay? Uh, I'm going to show them to you. Let me just go get them. Now, of course, when you're ordering paper plates online, you have to look at the dimensions. She thought she was getting a 10-inch plate. These are 7 inches, and they were $6.79. And they're not... <laughs> if you're dieting or you need a cake plate, that's probably okay. But um, not for everyday use, not for what we needed it for. We were hoping for the big plates. I can get this out. But these are as big as they are, and they're really small. Like, you can see the size of my head, and these are 7 inches. So, I think for six seventy nine, that was a lot of money. Uh, I believe there are 50 in here. And if they were 10 inches, I'd be like, okay, six seventy nine. that's a decent price. But even that, I think, is a lot for paper plates, something you're just going to throw out, you know. Unless, of course, you were my grandmother, and then you'd wash the paper plates a few times before throwing them out. Then we got plastic cups. Again, she did not look like the ounces. <laughs> These are $3.22. There are 30 cups and they are only four ounces. So basically you have, you know, this much that you can put in it and without spilling it. And she, <laughs> my mom's a trip. She doesn't drink, she doesn't do anything like that. She's like, oh, I could play beer pong with the boys. No, not with these, you can't. Um, but maybe you can use them for other things. Uh, if you want a quick sip of like orange juice in the morning, like a half a cup of orange juice, I guess this is gonna be good. And we will find a use for these, obviously. We'll, um, my grandson would spill this very, very quickly, so I would not let him use those. He's still using a sippy cup. So we're not gonna do that. But, you know, like I said, for the price, you could go to Dollar Tree and get those big red Solo cups for $1.25. Yes, you only get 10 or something like that, but you get three packs at the same price as the four ounce ones. And nobody really is gonna drink four ounces in my house anyway. And then the toilet paper. This has to be the funniest thing because they are the smallest rolls of toilet paper and she thought she was doing a good thing. There are two, four, six, eight rolls of toilet paper and it was $6.99 and she's like, oh, I'm getting a really good price on toilet paper. Well, the toilet paper is the smallest rolls, you know, you have seen. It really is. It's so tiny. I'm going to get my regular roll and show you the difference in size. Okay, so this is the Timu toilet paper. You're lucky if you can wipe your tissue three, maybe four times. I said use it for tissues. This is my toilet paper. Okay, you see the difference? <laughs> so this is just to give you a size comparison. And this was a lot cheaper. This was $5.98 at Big Lots um, for I think eight rolls, for four eight rolls as well. So I, these are not things I'd get at Timu unless Maybe you're a single person who never poops. <laughs> Maybe this would be good for you. But those are three things I would kind of avoid and get at a regular store or or something. Um, I, I think it's a pricey for, for what you're getting, for the quality that you're getting. So that was my Team Moon Haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, thank you for hanging out with me. Please like and subscribe and tell your friends because I'm trying to get to a thousand people subscribers, friends, besties, everything, and I'd love for you to be one of them. With that being said, be happy, be healthy, be blessed, and most of all, be positively you, because there's no one else quite like you, and that makes me so incredibly happy. You guys rock. Love you.